move on right to the other um uh, football chat of this uh, video from the, the football chat segment of the video so <clears throat> it's going to be a topic of manchester united um we would do we do the man united one again we would do the manchester united the topic of man united right now because i'm a united fan i just have to speak about this so manchester united so these are the draws right that was uh, concluded um this morning slash afternoon for manchester united in the europa league so these are the um eight fixtures that we have in the new format system right for the europa league like it's just like the champions league again it's this this literally just eight we're, we're, we're playing eight times four at home four away just like the just like the um champions league teams so at home right we have rangers at home we're going away to the St estadio do dragao that name for the stadium is sick fam the dragon stadium porto we're playing porto and then at home against power i really want to get tickets for that because i want to see number seven for park man like Yanis Costantelias, what a young baller he is. I really want to go to that game. Fenerbahce, so we're, re, we, we're doing a reunion, right, with Fred and Jose Mourinho, because Fred, of course, plays for Fenerbahce, scored a hat-trick the other day for Fenerbahce, and then Jose Mourinho was the previous Manchester United manager. We're playing at home, right, versus Bodo Glimt, and Bodo Glimt, they've got one guy, bro, what's um, Albert Grombeck. I want to go to that game as well to see how Albert Grombeck plays like, because I I I think that he, he might move to a, a, a different team like in the near future. A yeah, young striker, really good striker. Um, after we're away at Victoria Pilsen, so Victoria Pilsen I think is a team in Czech Republic. I, th I think it's Czech 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 Republic. That's we saw the Czech Republic or, or Slovakia. And then we're at home to FC Twenty. I think that Ten Hag managed these guys or he played for them. I'm pretty sure Ten Hag either managed FC Twenty. Or played for them. Let me see one second, guys. I, I think he played for them because I remember an interview where he just kissed some reporter. Well, you kiss, yeah, there you go. There you go. 996 2003. He played for them and he kissed some reporter. So he's, he's the he's manager against his old team that he used to play for. And then our final game, right, is FC Store Bucharest in Romania. So Manchester United are going away to Romania to play against um, Store Bucharest. For me, no excuses. I think the only two teams right, that would give us a tough time, in my opinion, should be Porto and Fenerbahce. We're away at Porto. This the, the fans there, hostile, um, hostile uh, uh, atmosphere. The Portuguese fans absolutely go hard. And Fenerbahce fans, it's literally going to be a, a replica of Galatasaray from last season. But the Turkish fans are mental, bro. In a good way, fam. In a good way, bro. Like, the atmosphere that these guys bring. Apparently, you can hear them from, that like, three kilometers out from, from Istanbul, bro. It's crazy. So, those are the three, and so those are the two games, right, that, for me, I should be worried, should be worried about as a United, uh, I, 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 as a United fan, bro. You might not should be being Rangers at home, should be being Park at home, should be being Border Glimpse at home, should be being uh, Victoria Pilton away, FC20 um, at, at home, and still, still because as well. I think we've got too much quality for them, but this is you never know. You never know, bro, because that's why I thought that could be Copenhagen game. They were sure to beat them. <laughs> we're sure to beat them last season. So hopefully that like, these guys absolutely show up. So yeah, man. And this is for me, this is a a cup that we should be aiming to win. This is a target cup that Manchester United Cyril Dessers is a, I know, bro. I know if a man like Dessers, bro. I, I remember him um, from like four years ago, like in uh, it was like in quarantine or like in lockdown, from where he he, he, he interacted with the fan over something, fam. I, 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 I forgot what it was. I, I forgot what it was, but I, I do know Cyril Dessers, bro. I actually do. But anyway, right? Um, the Europa League should be a trophy that Manchester United should be aiming to win, in my opinion, because. It should be again like Ten Hag's first season was Carabao Cup, FA Cup. Now it should be like a Continental Cup, Europa League. Europa League, yes, we, we can't win the Champions League because we're not in the tournament. Yes, we can't win the Premier League because, again, like uh, Arsenal, Man City, and maybe Liverpool are better than us uh, for this season, right? And it's going to be tough for us to win the Premier League, of course, because I, I don't think that our team's there yet. But Euro Europa League should be that trophy that we should be aiming to win, right? Slowly going up. But that's just my uh, prediction is right now uh, for the Manchester United fixtures in Europa League. These will get confirmed on Saturday as well, guys, um, because just the same time as the, the, the Premier League, the Premier League, the, the Champions League uh, fixtures as well will get confirmed, right? So let's move.